I'm in St. John's, Newfoundland on a very sunny, beautiful day. And behind me is one of the most important historical buildings in Newfoundland history. It's called the Colonial Building. And a group of people from Hamilton are restoring it so it looks like it did back in the 1850s. Let's go inside. I'm Laura Lemaire and I am in the council chambers of the Colonial Building. My company was commissioned to recreate all the original finishes from the mid-1800s in this building and we have been here since early March. Uh, we are almost in our fifth month and we should be done in about another six to eight weeks. The work involves the painstaking restoration of a series of ceiling murals originally completed in 1880. The artist, a fellow named Alexander Pindakowski, was serving penitentiary time for check forgery. Government justice officials offered him the chance to shave one month from his 15-month sentence if he would take on the ceiling project. Now the building that was originally built to be the House of Parliament for the colony of Newfoundland is earmarked to become a provincial history museum. Laurie and her crew are focusing attention on returning the interior to its 1800s artistic beauty. That involves faux marble, faux granite, and wood finishing, as well as the mural artwork. Mark McNeil for the Hamilton Spectator.